all right guys it's that time again mid month news dropped and today we got a lot of exciting news and most of the exciting news isn't even the characters we got it's more so the update aka the attribute tree now if you're a person that likes to grind the game the attribute tree is going to be really exciting if you're someone who doesn't like to grind too much then you might be turned off by this but before we get into that news, the attribute tree, let's talk about the new characters. As you can see, oh, let me scroll down. We, 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 we got mid-month is going to be Basby and Robert. Actually, you could have saw it up here. <laughs> you could have saw it up there. But anyway, before we talk about the attribute tree, let's talk about these characters. We got Basby and Robert, which are pretty cool characters. I'm not really a Basby fan. I'm not going to lie to you. I am not nowhere near a Basby fan. Uh, he's cool. Don't get me wrong. He is a cool character. He's just not my guy. Simple as that. He's not my goal. I know he's some, I know he's a very popular character, but I he's I just don't care for him. Enough about that. Robert Robert is pretty cool. I do like Robert. Um, I do think they did his character good. I do wish they had did something else with him. I'll, use, I'll get into that. What I um for after that. I also we also getting these these characters are coming back again. I don't know why Caleb are making bringing these guys back. These guys were filler. These guys are filler characters now. I don't know why we're, we're giving dedicated reruns for filler characters. I don't know what the fuck went to bad banner. Also, the, the, this banner also has pretty mid filler to Ishin. Ishin? Fendor? Are we kidding here? Are we kidding? Shaolong? Kali's good. Ichigo, he can't be good for the Robert Farmer. But right, right, let's get into that, what these characters do. Also, I don't know why the person who usually um posts these, he made them as a two separate images instead of making it just one big image. But whatever, we're going to keep it going anyway. Um, so right off the bat, Basby is a melee Soul Reaper Killer Plus. Um, he has fire all of its, of course he has fire all of its has. Marauder, Havoc, and Sprinter, and he's a 14 star link. Oh, I didn't see that earlier. He is your standard guild quest character. I'm not gonna lie, he doesn't do anything interesting. He does everything, he does, he's literally just like every other SP guild quest character. You know, standard, devastation. No Berserker, Debilitator, 80, extra 80% damage towards burning enemies. Uh, Disabler, weak in defense. This is, this is, this is every, this is, this we get this every month. I'm sorry. He does literally, he's literally, the la he's literally last month's, um, uh, fucking mid-month Guild Quest character. Just now he has burn in a different duration. That's, he's literally just, he, he doesn't do anything special, new, no new mechanics. He does have a trapping vortex, not trapping vortex, a trap on his third. So there you go. Do what you. Now let's talk about Robert. Robert's an actually interesting character. Robert is a sadly he's a nat character, but he's actually a little bit um he's doing a little bit of um different things that than what we usually get. Sadly he he does he is a standard he got the standard guild quest build flurry plus two only in guild quest. We'll talk more about that later. Not really much talk about actually. He's a wrong card killer, no wrong card plus. Don't know what we're doing here. Guard break, dodge instead of star barriers. Does he have star barriers? No, they, they've never they've never given a character dodge and star barriers. Um, how to feel about that? Uh, long reach, bruiser, enhancer, booster, the 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 standard stuff. It doesn't it doesn't show it here. It doesn't show it here, but he does have a. So this, this is why I wish that the person would screenshot the whole thing. I'll be able to show you guys. But he does have a, um one of those abil those skills or abilities where if he gets if he gets enough kills he gives what he would do is he gives an additional twenty percent team b berserker so if he gets enough kills your main runner gets more damage he also have he also makes it that he makes it that tech characters do an extra twenty percent on extra damage on a normal attack so he boosts normal attack tech tech uh tech nat characters and he boosts your main runners as well. I, I, I like the idea of this. I'm not going to lie. I like the idea of this. I feel like Caleb was trying to do this. They tried to do something similar like this way back with Heart Stark dropped. But it just it just didn't work out with Heart Stark. And so he so boost everybody. He is a great boost character. I hope I hope they make more characters like him in the future, actually. I think they did I think they did really good about this. Um so this is one thing I I don't I don't I don't I wouldn't say he's a boring character because he's he's doing he's boosting, he's doing a lot of newer things. I said I say newer thing. He's doing something different, you know. He's he's, he's heading in a, a good direction, oh, but he would be a, a perfect character if they just made this for all game modes. Now I have heard that um, Eisen, who he's gonna be pair, who, who he's usually gonna pair him with. I know this guy has a, he's an E booster, and Eisen is not, so his 
But most likely or not, you're probably going to pair this dude with Aizen anyway. So, I know Aizen does actually do more damage when he has the 80% attack boost. But I still think that this uh, e um, Robert is still a really good character. Um, um, yeah, but that's enough talking about what he does as far as... He also has this. Um, that's the name of his ability. I, re I was really hoping that his ultimate wouldn't, his ultimate would have been the name of his swift because we don't know what it does. <laughs> but then it starts with a G. Like, oh, never mind. <laughs> his swift is he's he's letter N. He's letter N. If 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 his special would start with N, that could have maybe told us what his, his swift did. But no, 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 no. Uh, we also have this premium premium trash. No one cares. Now let's get into the gameplay. Free Souls team. Oh, that's loud as fuck. Oops, let me, let me uh, mute that. Yeah, let's get to it. All right. If you want, if you want, if you, if you want to see the day, turn the captions off. I need to see that. Now, Basby actually has a really good kid. He has a really great kid, actually. Yeah, he, he has like he has like the OG uh demi god kid, OG god kid. So yeah, um, I'm gonna talk more about Basby after this, after this, after this. something about Basby. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about. Actually, I'll talk about right now since we, you, you look at his kid. He has got, he has Demi God kid. So, so the thing about Basby is that, um, as you can see, True Shika Ichigo is is right here, and I've heard that True Shika the damage Basby is like only slightly, slightly better than True Shika Ichigo. So if you're somebody like me who has a max transcendent, or you don't feel like summoning for another melee sword killer because you have true go i think that you're just you're not really in the wrong for doing that because let's say basby is only slightly better than him slightly from what i've heard because and on, and on top of that is like ichigo has like better status effects he, he has well, he has the weakening and he has the last ray so you can get your support characters characters like 40 percent extra damage you know his, his skills his skills even scale higher than him um but like the only reason I'm pretty sure the only reason Basley really is only better does more damage is because of his killer plus effect. I'm guess that's what I'm guessing. I, I didn't really crunch the numbers, but that's what I've heard. So that's again, if you don't want to summon for Basley because of Ichigo, you're more than welcome to. Would I recommend summoning for him? The only reason, the only way I would recommend summoning for Basley if you don't have Ichigo. That's that's it. Or if you're a Basley fan, if you have an Ichigo. Like two out of five and up, or if you have a max transcendent, I would be like, you probably don't really need Basby like that. Basby will be better, but not by my. By the way, Basby's ultimate, Ichigo's ultimate also like is does way more damage than Basby, I think, because he has bombardment. Ichigo has bombardment, so yeah, that's that's Basby basically. Basically, also another map eight skills if you haven't noticed, and Robert. Now we're gonna skim through Robert because he's a nad character. There we there there we go. Here it is. I couldn't show it off in the screen in the, in the thing. If he if he gets thirty kills, I'm pretty sure that's where. If he gets thirty kills, he doesn't. Your everyone gets an additional twenty percent berserker. Really fucking great. Really fucking good. Let's, let's look at his. Let's look at his visuals. His nat is his nat is really clean and his strong attacks. Are, I like I like how his strong attacks are really are really are really fast too. Like look look at them. That's his second strong attack. That's also a second. Can, can we show his first now? His strong attacks are really fucking. He really, he's really zooming around here, zooming about. Really, I really, I really like that. I just wish he would show us other strong attacks. Can we show us? Oh. God damn, I hate that. Hey, lab, show the fucking strong attacks. Okay, there you go. See, see, he's zooming around there. It's really, it's really fast. He would have been a great Nat. He would have been a really good SP character if they had made him one. He would have been really good. The second is, you know, the second would have been a little bit iffy because it's a, it's a beam. It's another beam. Um, my, my only problem, I have another, I kind of have a gripe with the second strong attack. Where, he, when he uses it, as you can see, he kind of, he goes backwards. I don't, I'm not the biggest fan of him going backwards because if you, if you know, if you know how in Guild Quest, which you're going to be able to use them in, um, y'all know Nat characters act stupid, and then they always use their strong attacks. And having a strong attack that puts that puts them further away from the bosses is kind of annoying, because it it only means not it only means that now they gotta walk more forward. But that's kind of a nitpick. It's probably not even gonna mean that much. But we get back into it. Show if show if it's third off. Can, can you show it off? Pretty pretty cool. Pretty cool. Pretty pretty flashy. No no. Pretty flashy. You know, let's move, let's move on to it now. 
I, I, I like the visuals. I, um, I like this character. They, they didn't, they did him, they made him a lot cooler than I actually ima- would have thought. I, I feel like both these characters are kind of done justice for what they're trying to do. I do feel like Basby should have been an end of the month character. He should have been more powerful. Um, and I wish they would have made him more unique. But um, other than that though, the, I think they're both good, great characters. Um, um. I don't really, I don't really, but I don't really think they do anything too, too different though. I feel like they kind of, they kind of like carbon copies of other cutter. Robert is trying something new though, but other than that, they are cool. But they are, um, they they cool. Now that's 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 good. Let's stop talking about that. Now, now, now let's talk about the attribute tree thing. Let's move it now. Here we go. So here's the tree thing. As you can see, as you can see, we have um. All these colors, all these are going to boost the stats and stuff. And these triangles, I'm pretty sure, are going to give you other effects like, um, other effects like Berserker, Level Up. I think Level Up, yeah, Level Up should be here somewhere. I'm not sure which of these will do that. Oh, by the way, if you guys didn't know, I kind of spoiled it already, saying that. Well, this tree does a whole lot more than just give you stats, by the way. It gives, this tree does a whole lot of other things. Now, if you see, if you see here... Oh, as you can see too, we we got a new match. Of course, it's gonna be new match for him. The tree is going to give you extra level ups. By the way, this goes to everybody, so you don't have to. It's not by. It's not. I'm pretty sure it's not like oh, I I I give this to Ichigo, and I and it, it boosts up his level cap. And now I gotta do this for each character. No, this goes for everybody in the everybody in that set attribute. So if you increase this Ichigo, this attack one. When, if you if you increase this one's level cap, you you increase all the other green characters' attri- um level cap, and so it's so whatnot. And if you were to max out all of this, th- I'm pretty sure there's like three pages worth of stuff like this. Three pages, I believe. Th- this is what you would get as far as stats and stat wise and other things like Bruiser, Berserker. I don't know if there's anything else besides these thing thing. I'm pretty sure it's all. As you can see down here, they got some little interesting things like you inc- I'm you increase coin drop. I don't know if this is percentage percentage based. I would guess so, or if it's just not because if it's just straight up 190 coins and not percentage wise, that would be kind of useless. And the crystal, thing. even though in my opinion these aren't really all that needed. Um, I really wish they would add in something like increase potion drop. Like I'm like, like if it's just like only by three and drop it as well, that would have been really cool. You know, make every character a potion character. <laughs> Because coins and crystals are like nothing, though. I would rather have more Berserk and Bruiser. And do keep in mind, though, ev- all of your characters get Bruiser plus 40 and Br- Berserker plus 40. So if, if you were to max this all out for an attribute, that is going to be that, which is really amazing. Which is really amazing when you think about all your characters worth Nat and SP characters increased by this. Now, and then keep in mind that you're getting all of this, and this isn't even factoring the amount of stats you get for leveling up your char- leveling up your character. I'm pr- it doesn't. I'm not sure how far this goes. I think it was said to that somewhere that this goes up to 300, so level 300s. Uh, do qu- don't quote me on that. I don't know if it goes up to 300. I don't know if it's it was if, if this information was confirmed that it go up to 300, but it should go up to 300. It should go up to 300. Now. That's not and the funny thing about it. We have more to talk about. We have more to talk about. We have more to talk about. Now, as you can see, as you can see, these will be the accessories for the attribute tree. And as you can see, you can see these, the this potion and this another scroll. Oh my God, dude, guys, the amount the amount of new levels of power our characters are gonna be able to do is gonna be insane. Now, what is this? This is right here is what is what is gonna allow us to do T thirties. This is a rainbow one. Um, I don't know if there's only gonna be one one color. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be one for all the co- uh red one, a blue one, yada yada. But this is a so this is the super uh it's called a secret link slot potion, and these are going to allow us to do T thirties, which was D data, data mine two years ago. If anyone doesn't know that. man, so it's already been confirmed that T it's gonna be T thirties. We don't know. If there's gonna be any new skills or new effects that hasn't been he uh he can hasn't found anything about that yet. But this is gonna allow us to, to allow this right here, this new scroll is gonna allow us to go beyond level 10 for our transcendent slots, which is gonna be interesting. I don't know if it stops at eleven. It like eleven is such an ugly number to stop on, so I'm a, I'm guessing it should be able to go level twenty or, or whatnot. So that's gonna that's gonna be enough. Uh that's gonna be really fun, really cool. Now looking at this now. 
here's some some more some things. Um, attribute trees. This tells us about what I thought this goes on to attribute each other after nuts. Uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna link you anybody to this. You could probably find somebody for this whole attribute tree documents whatever. But now let's go into this. Now each from now from transcendence level 11. It, it, this is what the stats will add. 111 stamina, attack, whatnot, whatever. Um, it so they say it's gonna require one of these quint quintessential scrolls. One is such scroll, scroll 10, 20, 10 large one, 20 medium, 30 smalls, 10 affiliation, 20 stands up in 1.5 million. That's a lot of coins, but ain't nobody bitching about coins. You can easily find these up. Now, what are this? What does this mean? That means if if there if we can level if we can level past 11 up to 20, that means we're gonna for each level past 10, <laughs> it's gonna need an additional essence scroll for those who don't know essence scrolls have kind of been you know the stocks for these have kind of these have been high demand as of right now <laughs> i have a decent amount I, i'm still over 100 of these I had, I had to stop using them to get up to a back to 100 so if if this is true if we can go past up to 20 we're gonna need more essential scrolls and even on top of that when we get to level 20 it's probably gonna take like i wouldn't be surprised if it took like an extra five just to go from 19 to 20. Can I like to do some things where when you get to the last, the final level of things, they like to bump up the requirements from the type of things. Like when it comes to T20s, you notice so how going from 15 and up, you need more potions from going from 10 to 15. I wouldn't be surprised if, you know, when we get, if, if, if when we get past like uh, 15 essential scrolls, level 15 and up, it's gonna go, it's gonna require more than two. Like this, this, this is the things they've done before, but it's not, it's not, um, it's not, it's not confirmed yet whether that. And if you if you read into the bottom spot, it has says that the max level for uh for T, t this this is confirmed T30. We, we we don't know what effects if it is any additional effects outside of extra, um stats. It, I'm I would guess I'm hoping they add new skills. I'm really hoping they do like guard break, and. Uh, just stuff like that. I'm not gonna go into what I wonder because I don't want to raise expectations for that. We don't know if it if it has have any new things added to it. I would imagine with this update where they would add like extra damage towards um toward dominated enemies, aka that's what Gis Giselle what he has because he doesn't have his ability to do extra damage as far as skill wise. So that's one thing about it. There is a skill for it, but you can't add it from T20s. That's something that I want to note about. Um, but, so, uh, that's pretty much all we got about this. Now, there's some things I want to talk about, because I know some people are going to be like, oh, no, it's going to be, the grind is going to be horrible, and whatnot, and this is one thing I want to say, is that I, w I am going to say that when, when this first goes live, the grind for this is going to be very, it's going to be a very painy ass at the early stage, like, when T20s first hit the market, this shit was grindy as fuck, bro. I, it, it was so grindy as some, I'm a grinder, right? I'm I'm kind of getting I'm kind of washed up because I'm getting more and more casual. I'm like I'm not even an S three guild anymore for those who don't know, but that's not much about me. Um, this this is if this is gonna this I'm I'm guarantee you this is gonna be a probably a pain in the ass when this first drop. But for anybody who's like oh it's grind this stuff uh, down the line this will be made more easier. And another thing to talk about this is we probably are gonna get new farming characters for this. I know it's gonna be a pain in the ass. These things are always a pain in the ass at the earlier stage of things. You know, Caleb gotta make their money. After we get like our first batch of uh, crest, these are called crest. If you haven't seen up there, these are called crest. These are gonna be a pain in the ass to grind the earlier stages. They're gonna make new farming characters, but as time goes on, this will be made easier as time goes on. So. I know it's gonna be a pain in the ass now. It's gonna suck. It's gonna be suck for everybody. It's gonna suck that's not just for you, it's gonna suck for everybody. But as time passes, these are gonna be easy. These are gonna be made easier for it. Um I I'm, I can imagine Caleb is not allowed to do time five um runs for this. I hope they do. I really hope they add time five for this because when it came to super potions, we didn't start with times five. They started I mean, we had to do one run at a time to get the T twins and it was horrible. It was horrible. I was there. I'm really hoping that they don't do that for this, but they probably is gonna do that. They could do it one by one, so it's gonna be a pain. But uh, guys, guys, if if this is if you're a casual, if you're a casual, don't stress this. Do not let this stress you out. Grind as much as you can. Grind as much as you want, or don't grind it at all, and wait for these 
of these items become more accessible. You might, if you're like A rank guild, it's probably not gonna. It might affect you when when A rank niggas start doing it, yeah. But uh, this is man, this this is really gonna hit the S rank niggas. If you're S rank niggas and you're grading this, yeah, you have you're gonna be grinding this, buddy. You, this this is this is for you, buddy. <laughs> you're gonna be grinding this. <laughs> See, for me, I'm in I'm in a fucking E rank guild or a, a F rank or at the bottom because because uh, um I I left my S rank guild or they they pretty much kicked me out because I didn't want to grind anymore. I I cause I was I was a slacker. They they rightfully kicked me out, <laughs> rightfully. I was waiting to be kicked out, but so uh, <laughs> I am gonna be grinding this. By the way, I am definitely gonna be streaming for that. So if y'all are looking, for, so you know, if y'all want to see how bad the grinding is, and you know, I'm 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 gonna be one hundred percent grinding this with my with my homies who, who come through. You know, I know that Aaron and all the other niggas are gonna be grinding this out. Um, I'm probably not gonna grind it the same day that I'm not. I'm probably not gonna grind it the um. As soon as it drops, because it's gonna, it's gonna drop during like maintenance and shit. I'll probably wait to grind it during like noon or down that line type of thing. So if you're dreading this, dreading this, don't, don't let this stress you out. We are gonna get posted. This, 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 we are gonna get farming characters on this. Even though this does make me kind of wonder that if the older farming characters are gonna be not nowhere near as useful. That does that does make me kind of afraid for that because we just got like. A good super pot farmer, good farmers for all the colors except for red. Red was the only attribute that never, to this day, to this day, did never got a good super pot farmer. Crazy, absolutely crazy, dude. But like I said, this is a lot of um, in my opinion, this is a lot of excited things because I've 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 asked for t thirty t um uh t thirties. I've asked for a level three hundreds a long time ago. I'm actually really excited for this to to drop. I'm not gonna lie to you. I, this is something I've wanted. Um, and even even though now that I'm casual, though, this is this isn't gonna matter to me anymore. Because and nowadays, since I'm in a um, I'm in a no, I'm pretty much in at the bottom of the fucking guild thing now. This doesn't. I don't. I don't even have to really do this anymore. And or whatever. Um, but like I said earlier, don't let this stress you out, guys. Please don't be, don't let this stress you out. I know a lot of people are gonna be looking at this like, oh man, I gotta quit the game now. They're gonna be, they're gonna be stressed. They're gonna let this be like, oh man, the game is over. I can't keep up with the meta. Don't, like I said, I'm gonna, I know I said this a lot, but I, I'm, I'm telling you guys, I'm saying it a lot to get you to realize, don't let this stress you out. Do not let this stress you out. But anyway, I think I've said enough. Um, far we're, gonna, we're gonna get a new batch of farming characters for these, for these, um, for the, the super secret pods, and probably the crest too. I won't, I won't be surprised if the crest became like a, um, something you farm through a like, I don't know, I don't, I don't know, I, don't, I really don't know how, how they're gonna, how Kel's gonna go about dropping these items. But this is definitely gonna be a new f farming character for this, and most likely this. Let me know how you guys feel about this. I am I'm pretty excited. I, I don't want to be too excited. I don't want to be too excited cuz like, when you when you when you get too excited, you get that's, that's how you get um disappointed when the thing you're really excited for doesn't live up to expectations. So um I think I've said enough about this. Um let me know guys how you guys feel. I'm ex um I can't wait for this to drop and um I'm definitely going to be grinding this. I hope to see you guys when I do grind this. Even if you guys can't join in the runs. And that's going to be it though. I'll catch you guys later.